Hello everybody, my name is Lana Baric. I'm a, a screenwriter of the film um, Eve After the Fall. Uh, and I'm very happy to be the finalist of your competition because I was worried, I didn't know whether this story will, will find, um, whether people will, will connect to it and understand what I want to say. And, uh, and I'm really happy this, this actually does mean that it, it does make some kind of sense. And uh, thank you very much. I was really happy. So it is a great, great, um, great news in, 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 on the first day of the new year. And I wish you all have a happy one. Uh, and all of us, uh, much, much, I wish all, all the, the easier times will happen and come in the future. Well, I really had the need uh, to tell a story uh, about uh, a woman that finds her own truth and liberation after a catastrophe because after the, the earthquake in Zagreb really happened last year, we were all really scared and everybody was, uh, we were all like little mice hiding. We didn't know what to do because it, it is a, such a huge thing and the earthquake was enormous. Many buildings got destroyed. They're still not repaired. Uh, our government is really slow in this kind of thing and it's really horrible. 20,000 people love the city center of Zagreb where I live. I have, um, I had a huge luck that I'm living just outside of the city center and uh, it's a concrete building. So it wasn't destroyed as much, only the chimneys and the roof. But, um, oh my God, the, the other buildings uh, were horrible. Some of my friends who lived in the city center thought that, that there was a, that it's the end of the world because of the noise and, and the things falling everywhere. It was really, really dangerous. And some of the people who didn't have anywhere to go, they were uh, placed in this student center, student dorms. And uh, this is actually, yeah, it's based on, on, on a true natural catastrophe that happened to all of us. But instead of us being really scared and little, I wanted to uh, show a story of a woman who used the natural catastrophe to liberate herself and to find her own truth, because there is a certain amount of um, um, Balkan stories that people expect and accept. And I didn't want to say that kind of a story, you know, uh, because uh, here we are still very much patriarchal. And uh, here um, many women don't question um, their lives or what it is, they just follow the pattern. They get married, they have children. Not many of us question whether we want to have children, really, or what do we want to do? What do we want to accomplish? And I wanted to um, just show a woman that, you know, at uh, the story of a woman who at one point in her life um, wanted to liberate herself and do something for herself, maybe for the first time in, in, in her life. And thank you very much for recognizing the story. I'm really, really happy. Um, I really am. And what a way to start the year. Thanks very much. And I wish all the other contestants all the best of luck.